Hey Professor Jordan, it's uh, Brian here. And today I'm gonna to talk to you about my favorite aspect from the class so far. While I do think that there are a bunch of different aspects that we've learned that's actually been very helpful and very, um, what's it called, progressional in helping me figure out and like assess uh, people doing communication, whether it's just in personal lives or in management slash business slash corporations, I've noticed it a lot more. And one aspect that I've always personally struggled with was delivering bad news or having any of those um, bad news incidences where something goes wrong, um, but you say the wrong things or you don't know what to say. So for me, learning this aspect is huge. Um, but the main the main point that I really learned was even though you did something wrong, you might have messed up. You don't all you don't say I'm sorry. You don't say I apologize for that. Um, you basically talk about the problem talk about what happened and you talk about how you're going to fix the problem and how it's never going to be a problem again while letting them know, you know, Hey, we know we messed up, but we're absolutely going to be the people that can absolutely help you moving forward, you know, and don't let them question you and don't let that become an issue. Cause if you over apologize or anything like that, it just seems like, Oh, they're just trying to cover their tracks cause they can't fix nothing. But in reality, they might, that might not even be the truth. You know, it's all about how you communicate. It's all about how you talk about it. And, especially for like a client, like they want to know that you're absolutely the most confident because um, you need to fix their problem. They need a problem fixed and they're not going to go to somebody who just messed up a problem and now they don't know what to say or how to fix it. You know, being confident is really the big thing that I found through this class is if you can be confident, you just communicate and you can stay calm. You're going to be, you, you can figure it out. You know, there's a lot of different, there's a lot of different communication skills that go into this, this class and management, but the most vital aspect I've found so far is absolutely learning. Um, if you have bad news or any type of bad news in a uh, management, uh, opportunity that you need to know how to figure out those. And this class and this section, uh, this chapter, I believe chapter 11 has been very beneficial in helping me understand how to do that. And if I mess up, understand how about how to go about that and how to stay confident and show that I'm the best man for the job. So thank you so much for that. And I really do love this class. So make sure y'all keep it. All right. Thanks very much. Have a good one.